wireless connectivity for hard to reach areas. Let me start by explaining why we are saying hard to reach areas and not remote or distant areas, long range links or something like that. Hard to reach areas might actually not be that remote, that far away, but there might be other reasons we cannot build a wired, a fiber or an ethernet connection to them. They might just be across the road from where we are, but we're not allowed to cross that road with a cable, fiber, something like that. So the places we like to reach with wireless connections, they can be anything from close to very, very far away, but they might be hard to reach and wireless might be our preferred technology to actually connect these places. The things we want to talk about here, and this is a very, very condensed, a very short talk, a crash course. The things we would like to talk about here is a little bit of physics, the foundation, what we're dealing with when we're dealing with wireless connections. We'll be talking about a very strong and useful tool, a technique, that of making a link budget. And we will apply this link budget to both point-to-point -point links, but also links between an access point, a wireless access point to an end user, a laptop, a mobile phone or such. Obviously, we will need to talk about antennas, antennas being the units that actually makes the wireless connection in a sense. And then lastly, we will look at some of the hardware that's available for building these types of wireless connections. Mm -hmm.